everyone. Thank you for joining me. 大家好，我是兰迪老师。我们在课文的第一百三十九课学习了 Graham 打电话想要找 John， 结果打错电话的故事。其中重点学习了是否的问句表达，用 if 引导的宾语从句。在今天的对话音频当中，你会听到这样的问句 ：Are you tired? What does he want to know? He wants to know if you are tired. 咱们同学们需要根据图片的具体信息做出不同的回答。那我们接下来带着今天的期待，直接进入实践练习时间，开始本节课的 repetition drill. Ready, go. Lesson one hundred and forty. Repetition drill. Are you tired? What does he want to know? He wants to know if you are tired. Why is Mary late? What does she want to know? She wants to know why Mary is late. Does Tom get up early? What does he want to know? He wants to know if Tom gets up early. Is Tom doing his homework? What does she want to know? She wants to know if Tom is doing his homework. What are you cooking? What does he want to know? He wants to know what you are cooking. When does Tom arrive? What does she want to know? She wants to know when Tom arrives. Will the children go to bed early? What does he want to know? He wants to know if the children will go to bed early. When will you have a bath? What does she want to know? She wants to know when you'll have a bath. Did Tom go to bed early? What does he want to know? He wants to know if Tom went to bed early. When did Tom go to bed? What does she want to know? She wants to know when Tom went to bed. Are you tired? What does he want to know? He wants to know if you are tired. Why is Mary late? What does she want to know? She wants to know why Mary is late. Does Tom get up early? What does he want to know? He wants to know if Tom gets up early. Is Tom doing his homework? What does she want to know? She wants to know if Tom is doing his homework. What are you cooking? What does he want to know? He wants to know what you are cooking. When does Tom arrive? What does she want to know? She wants to know when Tom arrives. Will the children go to bed early? What does he want to know? He wants to know if the children will go to bed early. When will you have a bath? What does she want to know? 
She wants to know when you'll have a bath. Did Tom go to bed early? What does he want to know? He wants to know if Tom went to bed early. When did Tom go to bed? What does she want to know? She wants to know when Tom went to bed. 在今天的课程里，我们将重点学习以下的内容。首先，在词法方面，我们要学习使用 if 和 whether 的句型。在句法环节，我们要学习宾语从句引导词的选择。我们首先进入词法的第一个部分 ，if 和 whether 都表示是否，那它们引导宾语从句的时候呢，居然是可以互换的。来看第一个句子啊 ，I don't know if it is going to rain。它等于 I don't know whether it is going to rain。这两个用法是一样的，但是以下的这些情况。只能用 whether。我们来观察一下，以下这几个情况到底特殊在哪里 ？I'm not sure whether or not it's good。我不确定这样好不好。Whether or not。If 用不了 ，if 只有一个词。第二句 ，She asked me whether to go。她问我是不是要去啊？这里面 whether to 是吧？也不是一个词。第三句。I'm thinking about whether he should go. 这里面 whether 前面还有个介词啊、哦，大家明白了。如果只有一个词，那么 if 和 whether 都可以用。那么，但凡有其他的词来干扰，咱们只能用 whether， 是不是一目了然？以上是词法，我们来看看今天的句法里面，还是重点练习宾语从句，它的引导词的选择。那么，宾语从句做陈述句的时候呢，那么引导词用 that， 通常呢这个 that 还是不那么重要的被省略。I'm afraid that I don't understand 等于 I'm afraid I don't understand。那么宾语从句是一般疑问句的时候，那么引导词用 if 或者是 whether。My wife wants to know。If Mary needs any help, 是吧？这个两个句子之间只有一个连接词，哪个都可以。那么宾语从句是特殊疑问句的时候啊，那么直接用特殊疑问词。I don't know what you are talking about. 这个句子太常用了，我建议大家可以连续至少读三十次、五十次。I don't know what you are talking about. I don't know what you are talking about. 后面是个陈述句 ，you are talking about， 对吧？前面是 I don't know， 中间是个连接词 what。好了，以上是今天的全部内容了。我们来简单的做个小结，在词法方面，我们学习了 if 和 whether， 它在句子里面一般情况下都是可以通用的，表示是否。句子有三种情况，我们只能用 whether。第一种叫 whether or not， 第二种叫 whether to， 第三种。Whether 前面有 about， 它只能用 whether， 其他的情况跟 if 是可以通用的。那我们在句法里面学习了宾语从句引导词的选择，首先陈述句就用 that， 通常还能省略。那么一般疑问句呢，就用 if 或者是 whether。那么特殊疑问句就用特殊疑问词，要记住我们的疑问句要改成陈述句的句式。以上就是本节课的全部知识点了。现在是时候测试一下咱们的收获了，以考代练。因为我们最终啊是要实现提升能力，顺便考试。我给你准备了五道练习题，你可以暂停一下视频，看看自己能否全部做对。All right, let's take a look of question number one. 第一题 ，Excuse me, this is Jane. May I? 嗯哼 ，Andy. This is 是电话用语。那我们肯定是想说，哎，我想跟谁谁谁说话。May I speak to？ 那选项里面 B 正确。我能跟谁说话吗 ？OK。Number two， hurry up， we'll be late。啊，赶紧的，要不然我们就得上学迟到了。Late 
干什么迟到叫 late for。Late for school, late for train, late for A 选项正确。Number three, Alice invited me. 嗯哼 ，her party last Saturday. 好了，这里关键词来了。上个星期六，邀请我去参加她的 party. Invite 某个人到某个地方 Invite me to. C 选项正确。Number four. My boss wants me to do work this evening. 我们一般工作是早，从早上到下午，是吧？谁还晚上工作？一般都是加班，对吧？所以是 extra work。那么我们选项里都是 extra work， 到底哪个是对的啊？叫一些多余的工作 ，some extra。这个 some 是可以来修饰不可数名词的。这个工作哪里有个谱啊？是吧 ？Some extra work. B 选项正确。The last one, number five. John said he, 嗯哼 ，B, 嗯哼 ，my house at seven o'clock. 这是课文里面的圆的句型，对吧 ？John 说 he 肯定是过去式，所以只能选 B 和 C. Would would be 到我的家 at my house. C 选项正确。你都答对了吗？